It wasn't too long ago that the concept of buying things with a tap of a phone or watch seemed like science fiction. In the past few years, technological leaps have revolutionized how we buy things. And today, we're revolutionizing the way we define our monetary value. Cryptocurrencies and non-fungible tokens, also known as NFTs, are changing what determines the value of money and art. But how? The value of a traditional currency is pegged to commodities like gold or exchange rates, which are mostly governed by institutions that aim to ensure its stability and security. With cryptocurrency, there is no central governing body that determines its value. It also uses blockchain technology to provide built-in security against hackers. That's what makes it all so revolutionary and at the same time so risky. Cryptocurrencies are generally pseudonymous, so it's difficult to link a real identity to a cryptocurrency wallet, which makes it convenient for illegal activities. And without middlemen or much regulation, the cryptocurrency market has exploded. In just 12 years since its inception, it's reached a record high of $3 trillion in 2021. Less regulated markets are also more volatile. If you have one dollar today, you know it can buy you one ice cream cone and be fairly certain that it'll be the same next week. But one crypto dollar could be worth your entire year's income today and half of it next week. That's because the value of cryptocurrency rests much more heavily on external factors like psychological hype. One comment by an influential public figure can make a cryptocurrency's value either skyrocket or plummet by huge margins. It is this arbitrary value that gives cryptocurrency both its incredible profitability and high risks. And NFTs take this arbitrary value to the extreme. When you buy an NFT, you're not actually buying full ownership of the original digital product. You're buying a one-of-a-kind blockchain code linked to it. There are also entire collections of computer-generated NFTs. So can NFTs be considered works of art? And what justifies their million-dollar prices? But as controversial as NFTs are, there's no denying that it's a beautifully innovative way of securely selling digital artwork while allowing creators to retain commercial rights. They've also become a new means of fundraising for charities and even nations, such as in the Ukraine-Russia conflict. As the world shifts towards a digital economy run without physical constraints, we should take a careful and well-informed approach to adopting them. Starting with this issue of Read to be Sure, which covers the risks and rewards of cryptocurrencies and NFTs. Do your research. Navigate the hype waves with wisdom.